Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial. In this video tutorial, I will show you step-by-step -step different methods to clone yourself in CapCut for PC. Let's get started. I am using the latest version of CapCut for PC. Make sure to update the software before starting. I have added a sample video to the timeline. My goal is to clone this person several times. First, I create a copy of the clip. The easiest way to create a clone is to use the cutout tool. For this purpose, a person is automatically cut out, however, this only works with people. When the clip is selected, click auto cut. Processing will take some time, so please be patient. Now move the clip to the place where you want the clone to appear. Hide the lower clip and the result of the cutout becomes clear. Scale the clip to make it a bit more realistic. Preview the video in the player and adjust the clip until you are satisfied with the result. Repeat the steps to create another clone. Preview the video in full screen mode. That's good enough for me. The final step is to clean up. Move the playhead to the end of the first clip and trim the clips above it. Delete the overhangs. Do the same for the beginning. Now realign all the clips. Move that down a little further. Perfect. This is how you clone with the auto cutout tool. Depending on your footage, you can also clone using the crop tool. Create a copy of the video clip. Select the clip and crop it to remove the unnecessary people. Move the slider to preview the result. Press confirm. Now mirror the clip and align it. Remove any overlapping. Preview in full screen. This is how to clone with the crop tool. Another method to create the clone effect is by using masks. Here I have a cute dot clip. Drag the clip down to the timeline. Copy the clip. I use the key combination Ctrl C and Ctrl V. Align the copy above the first clip. Press the mirror key to create a mirrored copy of the clip. With the clip selected, click the mask button. 
have cut support six different masks. In this case, the rectangle mask will give the best results. Align the mask correctly. The dog has now been successfully cloned. Press the full screen button to better judge the result. If you look very closely, you'll notice a slight edge. To fix this, select the clip again and adjust the mask. Move the position of the mask. Use the slider until you get the best result. Return to the full screen mode. Perfect, you have the perfect clone. To summarize, these were the three different methods to create the clone effect in CapCut for PC. Choose the best method according to your footage. If you want to see more videos like this, hit the like button. See you in the next video.